time for the video of the day. I'm your host, Greg. Welcome. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about pushing on. You can tell a truck just drove in front of me, can't you? <laughs> it's, um, it's late at night and I haven't quite got started yet. Uh, I'm getting ready to here in a few minutes. But, um, you know, our, our society, in today's society, um, we tend to want everything now. And I, when I was in Amway, when I was in Amway, they called it uh, the microwave society. Instant gratification. You want it now. Uh, for example, okay, uh, you could cook macaroni and cheese in the microwave and have it in a few minutes. Or you could cook it on the stove and have it in 20 minutes, half hour. Okay. We'd rather do it in the microwave. Why? Because we want it now. And um, we don't want to sit and wait for things. And, and it's it's really, um, I think I think it's really hurt our society. Um, I was talking to Kelly the other night, one of our guys in the office, and he was talking about how when he first started driving, he kind of shunned the the uh, electric logs a little bit. But after a while, he kind of thought about it, and he's like, you know, this does make things a lot easier. It makes things easier is, you know, you don't have to draw lines. You don't have to count your hours and, you know, how many hours were you off duty? How many hours were you on duty? Not driving. How many hours were you driving? How many hours were you in the sleeper berth? You don't have to count all that anymore. It does it all for you. You don't have to figure out, you know, okay, I had this many hours today and how many is that off my 70 how many do I have left for the week you know do, you, do I have any rollover up this takes care of all of it and though our gadgets that we have are yep another truck went by uh, <laughs> all our gadgets that we have make our life easier my phone for example makes my life easier I don't have to dig my map out and look through the map every time I got to go someplace. I can bring it up on here and I don't have to go through them. Okay, let's see. One inch is 50 miles. So, okay, one, two, three, and figure out how many miles it is. I can write on my phone. It'll tell me the route to get there and tell me how many miles it is. And in my phone, on my maps on my phone, it will actually tell me how long it should take you to get there. Now, that's a car speed. Okay. So you get on the freeway, you can do 70 miles an hour. No, I can't do 70 miles an hour. My truck's top speed is 65. And that's if I can use the cruise. If it's raining and I can't use the cruise, then it's 62. But uh, sometimes we just need to keep pushing on. No matter, you know, how irritated we get over things. And uh, trust me, folks. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm not, uh, I get irritated over things instantly. Talk about instant gratification. I get irritated real fast. <laughs> Stan's my wife. Um, but you know, we gotta, we gotta realize that we gotta take some time to step back. Are you counting them now? <laughs> We got to take some time to step back and examine our lives. And just, you know, get to the point sometimes where, you know what? It doesn't matter. Okay? If we're going to do it, great. If we're not, hey, so what? You know, we'll do it tomorrow. Sometimes that's what it takes just to slow things down. And sometimes that's what we have to do. We have to slow things down. We have to, you know, we, we have to stop driving with our foot on the floor. We have to we have to stop um, grabbing things instantly, you know, and wanting things now. You know, um, you don't always get things now. Sometimes you have to wait for them. You know, and and what's the old saying? Uh, the best things in life are worth waiting for. That's true. Best things in life are worth worth waiting for. Now, you might say, Greg, 
where did you get the idea for this video? Well, I was I was watching a video on on uh, Facebook. It was, um, I think it was called simple simple crock pot chicken and dumplings. I love chicken and dumplings, and it was going through how to make it. But then when it got to the dumplings part, you know what the dumplings were? The dumplings were the refrigerated. Uh, um, rolls that you get, you know, the buttermilk biscuits, and you take the biscuit, and you flatten it out, and you cut it up, and then you put it in, and that's the dumplings, that's the quick way, okay, that's instant gratification, trust me folks, that chicken and dumplings, that'll taste good, but if you made those dumplings from scratch, ooh, it tastes even better, I guarantee it. It tastes even better. But it's going to take longer. Because it's going to take you time to make those dumplings. But it's going to be worth it in the end. And, you know, I forget that a lot myself. You know, take time to get things done. It'll be worth it in the end. All right? And and take some time for yourself. Okay? Take some time for yourself. Sit back and relax. Sit back and take it easy. You know what? I don't feel like running to the store today. We got food in the refrigerator. Eat what's in there. I don't feel like going to the store. You know what? The laundry needs to be done, but it's not overflowing. So you know what? I'm going to do the laundry tomorrow. You know what? I need to. I need to go to the gym. Okay, or I need to go. I need to go exercise. Whether you walk or ride a bike or go to the gym or whatever. Well, maybe you've been doing it a lot. Maybe it's time to take a break and give your body a rest for for a minute. And slow down. Okay? Um, But again, stop. Take a break. But don't stop completely. Keep pushing on. You're going to get to where you don't feel good? Keep pushing on. You're going to get to where you don't want to go any further? You got to keep pushing on. Okay? Stop. Take the rest. And take off again. All right? So... That is this episode of the video of the day. Uh, I didn't I didn't bring my my uh, thing up here, hang it up so I could you know do it hands free, um, like I have been doing. Um, it's in the back, and I'll be honest with you, I just didn't feel like going back and getting it. <laughs> I didn't. It's in the back. It's hooked up because I've been watching stuff, um, watching videos and stuff before I go to bed or before I go to sleep. And it's hooked up back there. So I just put my phone up in it so I don't have to hang on to my phone. And uh, <laughs> it's back there hooked up. I don't feel like going back and getting it. So I just, heck with it. I'll do it by hand. <laughs> we don't always need these little gadgets to make our lives easier. Do it without the gadgets every once in a while. Maybe it'll be better. Probably will be better. All right. So remember, like, comment, share this video. Let Everybody out there know that Greg the Crazy Trucker is out here and he's creating havoc no matter where he goes. And if you've been wondering, this is my pickup number when I get to my pickups. That's what the number is written on the back of my hand. So until next time, this is your host of the video of the day, Greg the Crazy Trucker saying, see ya.